So I made a little tool here. Um, just click on Tools and Mesh Painter to bring it up. And as you can see, there's this little square. And the square is the brush. So this is roughly where uh, whatever you spawn in will be at. And I've got a little slider here for range, so that'll change the size of it. Um, so you can be more accurate or not. Um, I'm going to set it to 10 just for testing with. And I have selected a birch tree. Uh, you can just drag an object or select it. And then you can just hold control and then right click and it'll start to paint things. Um, the second value is density. So in this 10 unit cube, it looks for, or looks to see if there's five things. So since there's five inside of this cube, it won't draw anymore. Uh, if I extend the range to say 40, it's only drawing them when it sees that there's less than five within this cube. Because I'm dragging, some are spawning on the edge as I drag it off the edge. It draws a few more, but you can increase the density and get a whole bunch of them. Um, and it only does it when you control right click, so you can right click and still move around. Um, now the reason for this is because I don't like Unity's built-in terrain painting for objects uh, because for one it doesn't paint colliders, for two it doesn't let you use scripts on them so if you wanted to make a custom like level of detail system or something it'd be a pain to do um, so that's why I did it, it's mainly for like grass and the reason that I cared at all was because uh, for VR purposes uh, you can't really have a billboard for grass um, because the billboards just look flat so you can have a mesh and a script that changes between the level of detail levels for making a 3d mesh to a 2d one in the distance so yeah that's it bye